Friends, beast hounds, countrymen. These are troubling times, difficulties, just difficulties. <laughs> Era were, and I'm trying to do my part. I'm doing my part by not going outside, getting weirder by the day. If you'd have said a year ago, you're gonna end up weirder, I'd have said, ha 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 ha. But seriously, so a terrible thing has occurred, and uh, my shopping delivery did not include any egg whites because they were out of egg whites. Every day I eat waffles, waffles require egg whites. Now I know that eggs have egg whites in them. Do you know that? Eggs contain egg whites? Yeah, it's not a separate thing. But I, I cannot bring myself to separate eggs and just throw away the yolk, you know, the bit that's full of all the good stuff. I can't do it, I, I can't, I can't do it. At least if another company separates it, if they waste it, that's on you, homeboy. You shouldn't make egg custard or something like, your manufacturer, manufacture something with it. So I've had to improvise some breakfast and I have improvised a delicious high protein baked oats recipe. You can make it like a brownie, you can make it like a blueberry muffin, you can put whatever the hell you want in it. You can cook it in the oven, you can make a bunch of them and then have them over the week. Or you can do them one at a time in the microwave and it's literally just as good. Like. I can't tell a difference. Super easy, super quick. Let's whip it up. Let's whip it up now. Ta to make this delectable, life-changing breakfast, you're gonna want some protein powder, some oats or oat flour, some milk, some baking powder, some sweetener, a filling of your choice could be chocolate chips, could be mixed berries. You could use protein granola. Could be whatever the hell you want it to be. If you have oats and not oat flour, you're gonna need to process those oats into oat flour. So I hope you got a good blender. Blend it. Scales and a bowl. Scales. So you want 35 grams of oat flour. Do, 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 do. Superb. I'm making a chocolate one, so I'm gonna use this whey protein Rocky Road flavor. It was one of those free samples that they gave me when I bought a crap ton of uh, other protein. It's pretty tasty, it makes a damn good brownie. A breakfast brownie. Who thought we'd ever be able to say that? Oh man, my diet's so tough, I had to have a breakfast brownie this morning. Oh, 35 I reckon. Well, I'm not letting it get away with that. 36 grams of protein, about a third of a teaspoon of baking powder, skabow. Teaspoon of sweetener if you think you need it. Adjust that up or down if that makes you happy, do whatever you want. It's just guidelines. We're just pirates here. Guidelines. That was my best fire impression. Guidelines? Yar! Guidelines! <laughs> you can use any milk you like, it's just the apocalypse, so we're drinking UHT. 105 ml or 105 grams of any milk of your choice. Oh, right on the nose! Smash in. Now give it a wang dangle. You could use uh, anything you want. I do have a whisk. Just fancy using a fork today. We can do about it. Huh? What are you gonna do about it? Wang Janglich. He's the man. The man who wangles his jangle. Give up. You could wang that just as it is in the microwave right now. One and a half minutes, two and a half minutes, depending on how strongly your microwave is. Mine is incredibly feeble. This is obviously a chocolate one. I'm gonna put some chocolate chips in there, but I'm gonna microwave it for a minute and then put some chocolate chips in and then finish the microwaving because then they sink about halfway or they sit on the top and they get all melty and nice, but not evaporated, you know, not like eviscerated, you know, when chocolate gets all like, sort of claggy. We don't want that, we don't want that, so we're not gonna do that. If you were doing a fruit one, I tend to use the vanilla protein, some frozen berries. I'd stick frozen berries in now because they need the time in the microwave to get 
good. If you're gonna do protein granola, I've used this as a topping. I tend to just stick it on afterwards because if you put it in the microwave with it, it just gets kind of soggy and loses the crispness that you want from your protein granola topping. He's the man. The man who makes breakfast. He isn't fast. Insert. One minute, measure your chocolate chips. See that? Savagery. I like eight grams of chocolate chips. And then one for the queen. Still eight. And then another one for the queen. Still eight. One more for the queen. Still eight. The queen's getting four chocolate chips today. Lucky queen. Bloody hell, hasn't she done well? Halfway through, got sort of a semi-stable situation. Sprinkle them chips. And then back in. Mm. <sighs> Feels weird having you this way around. Here's what the other end of the kitchen looks like. A door. Like that, do you? Huh? You like that? A <laughs> good door. Look at this. Door handle. What's good about it? Just pulls. No turning required. Oh! Huff that whiff. Woo! So what you end up with is this delicious bowl of breakfast brownie that is somehow still high protein and conducive to getting yoked. Let's dig in, then we'll do the macros. Then, I don't know, I guess I could show you how to do one in the oven, but it's not one of those difficult things. You know what? I'm gonna trust you. You're adults. I reckon you can manage. I make it in a loaf tin. I make it in a loaf tin, 210 degrees. Make maybe like four times this recipe, put it in here, whap it into four, stick it in the fridge, goes fine. What I would say is line your sheet with baking powder. You, baking powder? Baking sheet. Like, just make it a little, uh, I wanna say trebuchet, but that's not the word. There is a word for it. A sling, just make it a sling so that when it comes to take out, it's easy. Let's try this. Oh, mama. This is proper good. That bowl is hot. Like, dessert level good. Chalky chippies. You got the wrong chippies. Mmm. Texture is pretty unbelievable, to be honest. Like, how this can be diet food. I do not know. I mean, I do, because I made it, but it's too good to be diet food. Without the chocolate chips, it's still very good. My girlfriend eats this and she doesn't eat anything that's made with protein powder because she hates the texture. But this, she's been making it every day for several weeks and digs it. And that's with whey. It'd be even better with the whey casein because it ends up fluffier. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. It's amazing what good things can come out of tragedy, huh? Egg whites didn't turn up. No waffles. That's a tragedy. Now I'm eating brownies for breakfast. <laughs> Oh, it must be terrible for you here with no egg whites, Jack. Bloody isn't now. Mmm. Mmm. Look at that pocket of chocolate chips. Mm -hmm. Ridiculously good. You're right. No one saw. Just don't put it in a video. So let's have a look at the macros on this boy. Hey, 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 hey. 350 calories for this baked oat breakfast brownie. <laughs> Less than eight grams of fat, 34 grams of carbs, 35 grams of protein. I mean, come on, what, what better way to start your day? I am occasionally a landscaper, and if I have a hard day coming up, you know, like when you're a labor, laborer, you have to drop the H's off things. So if you have an hard day coming up, this is a great start. Mm, 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 mm. 
<laughs> so my 700 water, this took two minutes, 15, to be pretty damn perfect. I'm really tempted to make one in the oven so that I can show, so that I can show you how to make one in the oven because then I'll get to eat one. But I'm not gonna do that because I respect you and I know that you know how to operate an oven. That if I make you one and all the frozen berries are gone, I'm gonna be in trouble. 210 degrees, 20-ish minutes, 25 minutes. I mean, it depends how much volume you're doing, what you're putting in it. You'll know if it's done. It'll stop being wet. If it's mostly a solid, it's mostly done. The total protein blend vanilla with raspberries and blueberries in is freaking delicious. If you do it in the oven, stick some granulated sweetener that does caramelize like erythritol and you literally end up with a blueberry muffin crispy topped like delicious, delicious breakfast muffin. I forgot to do a f***ing thumbnail. Every time. As soon as there's food in front of me, I'm like, mmm, <laughs> damn it! Well, I kinda have to do another one. No. I forgot to do a thumbnail because I am a Norbert. Whatever you do, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Ding! And uh, yeah, enjoy this recipe. Super quick, super simple. It's hot, it's filling, it'll keep you going. It's high protein, it's delicious. The fact that it's a brownie, or a fruit muffin, that's, that's beside the point. You're eating, you're doing well. And it doesn't require egg whites, which is terrific. Anyway, enjoy this, whatever version you make, let me know. And as always, my friends, get them gains. Be well.